inserting table of contents for your report in Microsoft Word. Now, after you are done with completely compiling your report, now you would like to enter the page numbers for the same. So this would also be done by Microsoft Word automatically and you need not to worry about the same. So to do that you need to click over here on the table of contents somewhere over here which click over here we go on to references click over here on the table of contents and if you want with this title as you can see over here contents or table of contents to type it automatically you can click this one so it's basically a template but if you want to directly insert the page numbers and titles click on insert table of contents so by clicking over here on this tab we will be getting this type of options now here we need to select how many labels we want to add into this okay so here keep is from template and let's say we want to enter up to heading level 3 that is 1 1.1 and 1.1.1 now we'll go on to options over here and we'll set the TOC level that is table of contents level so here you can see that heading number 1 has a level of 1 heading 2 has level 2 heading 3 has level 3 now you might have also noticed that something was also equivalent to heading level 1 that is the titles such as abstract say table of contents list of figures are also ones which need to be included into table of contents and bear a similar importance to the chapter number titles so we will find out the style that we had used for unnumbered titles so here it is unnumbered titles and here we will place the TOC level same as the main titles that is chapter titles so it is one and click on ok so here you can see the format so we have heading level one unnumbered titles one heading level two and up to heading level three and we can click on ok and you can see the whole table has been generated automatically and here we have table of contents here we have roman numbers and here we have normal numbers thereby now let's see one added feature of this one let's say chapter number 3 ends by page 7 that is it ends on page number 6 and we insert two pages at the end of chapter number 3.2 so let's go over here that is that let's find 3.2 so here is 3.2 so what we do is we further extend it down by two pages so now chapter number four which was initially at seven now comes down to page number nine as you can see over here now let's see has that been updated by microsoft word so chapter number four is still at page number seven and so on everything would be updated by two pages so we can click anywhere over here and everything would become gray then we can click or that is we can right click and click on update field and it would similarly ask update page numbers only or update entire table we we'll click on update entire table and press ok so just observe this 7 would become 9 so if we go back to over here 7 has already become 9 and so on everything has been changed so this is all about inserting table of contents in microsoft word as well as updating them